Um, hey everybody, Sean Adams here with Heroic Voice Academy. Once again, I am our head of strategy here for the company. And I'm sitting here at a coffee shop, so I apologize for some of the background noise, but it made me think about like, those moments when you may be having high stakes conversations. Because uh, we help those C-level executives uh, make sure that they can either raise more money, awareness, or uh, support in every high stakes conversation they're having. And a lot of times people are like, well, I don't understand. I don't have a lot of high stakes conversations. I might just be sitting at my desk. But what I realized sitting here in the coffee shop is that's not necessarily, that's not true at all. That you're always having high stakes conversation. If you're ever having a conversation with anyone, that can mean a coworker, that could mean somebody who works for you, that could mean a peer, that could mean your boss, that could mean somebody you run into at a coffee shop like this, whatever it is, you need to be able to know that those opportunities are high stakes conversations. You never know who you're gonna have a conversation with, you never know how things are gonna fall into place. Um, somebody who I work with and coach uh, had a, happened to run into somebody who is a regional director for uh, a major pizza company. And he's a life coach and he was just talking to the person and they started a conversation, the guy asked what he does, he mentioned this, and all of a sudden the guy's like, oh my gosh, all of the regional managers are required by our boss to have a life coach, so I'm going to hire you. And if I like you, I'm going to tell you that all the other regional managers should hire you as well. So just out of a casual conversation with some guy who he didn't even know was the regional manager of this pizza chain, he's got himself a one new client and the potential for a lot more new clients all just because he was having a conversation about who he is and what he does, and because he knows who he is and what he does, and he's able to express that clearly. He knows his vision, his vows, his values, and he was able to express that clearly to folks. So this is the point of making sure you're ready for those high stakes conversations. If you do not have that preparation in place, if you haven't been practicing for it, if you haven't been doing everything you need to be doing for that, you're going to run into that problem of not being ready and not being nearly as effective as you wanna be. So I encourage you to take the time and get trained to become a world-class presenter and speaker. If you are not that, then you are going to run into problems and you are not gonna be able to raise the amount of money you want, get the amount of awareness you want, or get the amount of support you want. And every conversation is about one of those three things. So make sure you're ready for any high stakes conversation, be it in a coffee shop or the boardroom, you need to know that you're ready. And the way to do that is to have for training to become a world-class professional speaker and trainer. Hope that helps. Hope you guys are all doing well and have a fabulous day. Cheers.